Hello everyone, and welcome back to my Legend of Zelda Majora's Mask playthrough. Um, this video is a little different than the other videos, because there comes a point in every player's game where you must step back from the story and go collect some things. In Legend of Zelda Majora's Mask, there are 52 total pieces of heart and 25 total masks. Every little while, it's a good idea to go out of your way and collect both of these things. In this video, I show how to get some of the pieces of heart available to us before we go to the mountains, as well as how to get the blast mask, and by extension, the bomb bag. The first piece of heart we're going to cover here is the Swordsman School piece of heart. Uh, you have to go to the Swordsman School in whoa, Eastern Clock Town, I believe, and just talk to the Swordsman, and you'll want to take the advanced the expert course for 10 rupees, so you'll have to have some rupees on you before you can do this. Um, you can do this any time, it doesn't matter what day, as long as the swordsman school is open. Now, in order to get the top score, you have to target your piece of wood and do the jumping attack, just like that, for every single piece of wood. If you do this, you should be able to easily get the piece of heart at the end. The second piece of heart we're going to cover is the postman's hat. Well, not the postman's hat, but the postman piece of heart. Um, come to the post office after 6 p.m. on any day, wearing the bunny hood. Absolutely wear the bunny hood. Um, you can do it without the bunny hood, but the bunny hood makes it way easier. Um, talk to the postman, and he'll tell you how he's been practicing running exactly 10 seconds in his mind. Um, and he'll ask if you want to do it as well. The goal is to press A when it's down to exactly 10 seconds, which isn't easy. You think it might be easy, but it's not really. But the goal is once you finally hit 10 seconds, um, you will actually get the piece of heart. Our next piece of heart is that of the hand in the toilet. Um, <laughs> you'd think that'd be a kind of unpleasant piece of heart to get, but anyway. Um, in order to get this piece of heart, you have to have either a title deed or a letter on you. Um, I have a title deed here. And you have to... The only way to do this is after 8.30 p.m. Um, on any day. Uh, if you try and stay in the inn after 8.30 and you don't have the key, you'll be kicked out. So you come in after 8.30 and then you wait until midnight and this hand will come out and I'll be wanting the paper and in exchange it will give you a piece of heart. Yay! 
our next big thing on our list of things to do is to come and get the blast mask. Um, this can only be done on the first day. Most things will say 1 in the morning. It's not actually 1 a.m. It's more like you should be in North Clock Town at about 12.30 the latest. 12.30 a.m. the latest. Um, this is... You have to do this. It's not just a side quest. If you don't do it, then you can't continue on in the game without the bombs. But really, it's really easy. Uh, here I'm sort of following Sakon around, but you don't even really have to do that. You just uh, knife off his bag, and then wait for him to leave the screen, and the old lady will give you the blast mask. As well as tell you that the bombs will be available in the store in the next day. This next piece of heart sort of requires going all over the map. Starting in the southern swamp, going through the grotto just off to the side of the entrance, um, you'll see four um, of the uh, are they of these statues. You need to stand directly in front of the giant one, the largest one, and play uh, your character's song. It doesn't really matter. Like, I'm the Deku Scrub right now because of when in the game I'm doing it, but you can technically get this heart piece using the Zora Mask, the Goron Mask, uh, as well. Uh, you just have to make sure you stand in front of the large um, stone and play your character's song. The second one, well, maybe not the second one, but if you're going in, you know, in order, you need to blow up that stone by the entrance to the ocean. And then come on in here and do the same thing again, playing the stone, uh, playing the song in front of the stone. Again, you can do this as Zora and Goron as well. Now, the one right by the entrance to the northern mountains. And then finally, the one by the entrance to the Eastern Canyon. It's right next to the observatory. And then upon turning all four stones one color, either blue, red, or green, depending on your character, uh, you will get a heart piece. The next piece of heart you can get is found in a hole uh, by the entrance to uh, Milk Road. You can find the hole by following where the butterflies are hovering above. Um, just be careful of the bird. That's all I can say. Uh, and then you come in here, 
And this is the only place, fun fact, that you can ever find a pea hat in this game. Um, they were abundant in Ocarina of Time, but uh, in Majora's Mask, this is the only one. And just fight it, and then once it's dead, you'll get a piece of heart. Let's <laughs> go. 